The Cyclopes are among the most famous creatures in Greek mythology. These old beings have, as their main feature, just one eye in the middle of their forehead. The Cyclopes were already present in pre-ancient times. The first Cyclopes were the sons of Uranus and Gaia. Since they were deeply powerful creatures, Uranus feared being dethroned by them, and for that, he imprisoned them along with his other sons, the Titans and the Hecatone Ceres. The Cyclopes ended up imprisoned in Tartarus until they were released by Zeus, who wanted their help in the clash against the Titans. As a sign of gratitude, they forged incredible gifts for the gods. Poseidon was offered his powerful trident, able to cause tsunamis and earthquakes. Hades was offered a helm of terror, which gave invisibility to those who wore it. And Zeus was offered his powerful bolts, decisive to defeat the Titans. However, the Cyclopes, sons of Uranus, were killed by the god Apollo to commit an act of vengeance against Zeus. These were regarded as the first generation of Cyclopes. The second generation, in turn, was comprised of Cyclopes, sons of Poseidon. These lived on the island of Sicily, nowadays part of Italy. Polyphemus was the most famous of these Cyclopes. In one of his stories, he fell in love with the sea nymph Galatea. However, the Cyclops caught the young girl with the shepherd Aces. Maddened by his jealousy, he went after Aces and killed him, crushing him with a big rock. But Polyphemus got famous due to his encounter with the hero Odysseus. The Cyclops locked the hero and his crew in a cavern with the intent to devour them. The sagacious Odysseus had a brilliant idea. He and his sailors produced wine and offered it to Polyphemus. He was thrilled with that beverage and got drunk. The Cyclops fell asleep. Odysseus took advantage of the Cyclops' vulnerability and pierced his single eye. Even though he achieved his freedom, the hero also attracted the animosity of Poseidon, the monster's father. Some Cyclopes, sons of Poseidon, lived in Mount Etna, where they worked as helpers in the forges of the god Hephaestus. There was also the third generation of Cyclopes, which lived in the region of Lycia. These were famous for having edified the walls of the glorious city of Mycenae. Due to their incommensurable strength, they could carry out impossible tasks for any human being. The figure of the Cyclops is still part of our culture. We often find it in fantasy stories or in RPG games. In pop culture, the figure of this creature is also present, like the Cyclops leader of the X-Men and also Leela of Futurama. Not even the fury of the god Apollo managed to erase this grandiose creature from our history.